Hey, founder Lena, and today I am uh, sitting in my car getting ready for mass at a new power date. Before I go any further, if you're watching this right now, make sure that you give this a like, thumbs up, and um, hit the subscribe button so that you're notified. At the end of August, I'm going to have a very big announcement to make, and I'm only going to be making it here on YouTube. So you're going to want to get to to be the first to know about that. So make sure that you hit the subscribe button and uh, and give us a thumbs up and comment below. And hey, what are you doing today? Let me know in the comments below. What are you doing today? It's the first Saturday in August. What did you do today? Today, I covered a funeral. It's the first time in almost a year that I covered a funeral. Um, I haven't covered a funeral in a really long time. And so um, I did today and I uh, don't miss it. Um, I have to say, I uh, don't miss doing funerals. They're um, they can be great experiences. I don't say great experiences, but they can be um, satisfying experiences in the heart. But then they can just be like, oh, you know, oh, I was planning to go to the gym that day, or oh, I was planning to do this. And it used to be great because it was, you know, there was nice, those, those are nice stipends. But now I've just gotten to the point where I'm over it. And so um, I have to say that as a consultant and as a music minister, I am well aware that this is not going to be my bread and butter, at least not for now. And doing YouTube is not going to support me, um, at least not for now. And so I have to figure out what I want to do. And um, I was very blessed in my early 20s and 30s, you know, that I did very well financially, but I was also very foolish and that I didn't save my money um, like my grandmother told me to. And so right now it's like, well, um, you know, there's plenty of $10 an hour jobs that I could go do, but I mean, like, do I want to do that again? And, um, you know, I have to think to myself, like I have, I could if I want to, and I'm thinking to myself, do I want to do that? So, um, you know, I don't want to sound like a snob and say, oh, well, that's below me, but, you know, is that what I went to school for? I just really don't know what I want to do again. Like, and I have to say, like, I loved the little church job that I had that was an interim church job this last month. I had a lot of fun doing that, but I also know that that can get old really quick. And um, so I'm trying to figure out right now, uh, I know that being font sound and being a consultant is eventually going to take off. It's eventually going to be huge and I'm going to be able to support myself doing this. But I know that this is not the time for me to just do this full time. And I needed this summer to build my business, to build my brand, to learn, to explore, to have the freedom of not working for somebody else and enjoy that freedom. But I know that at some point I'm going to have to go back to work full time again. And I don't know what I want to do. I don't know that I want to go work in a parish again. I know that I don't want to do diocesan work. I used to think that I wanted to, but that's too stressful. And uh, I don't know. I don't know that I want to go back to work in a parish again. So I am just kind of figuring it all out. And um, I have another three, four weeks. Actually, I could go to the end of September and not work right now, and I'd be okay. And I could go even longer than that, but I don't. I don't feel like that's a good idea. Um, I could probably go until Christmas and be be okay, but I don't know that I want to do that. I'd like to have more money saved for a much rainier of a day. So trying to figure out how I want to go about this, how I want to go forward, and I kind of like just being the substitute, but I like being a long-term sub, and uh, you know, going into a new place for the first time could be a little nerve-wracking, and uh, you know. Some places are stuffy, some places are not, and so I don't know how people are going to respond. I'm kind of chill when I come in. I know I, I know my stuff. I know what I'm doing. Look at my nails. Um, and um, are my nails cool? Shout out to Christy David, um, who sent me these samples in the mail. Um, these are very cool. I'm going to be doing a review of these, actually, after playing four masks on a weekend. Did they hold up? That's going to be kind of funny, because it's to totally not like what I do on my channel. But um, I love doing YouTube. I love... And it's a lot of work, but I love doing it. And I know that I have to find a way to monetize my personality. <laughs> um, yeah. So I have to figure out how to monetize that. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do. But I just found a Lara bar in my car and I ate it. If anybody wants to see the wrapper. It was a cherry flavor. Look at my nails. Look at those colors too. Isn't that wild? It's so not like me. It was just so not like me. So out of character. This eye is bloodshot, and I don't know why. Um, my allergies have been nightmarish, but this is not like this is not from allergies. I, this is just itchy, and I'm, I hope it's not pink eye. Um, so let's see, what else do I have that's interesting to tell you about? Um, I went to the White House this week. You can watch. You can click the link that I'll put in the description box below this to go watch my video of the White House. And 
Yeah. Um, they ran out of maple flavored Justin's almond butter in the packets um, at the Acme. This is a tragic day. This is very tragic. Maybe I'll leave my hair down. What do you think? Should I leave my hair down? Should I leave my hair down? My hair down. I don't like my hair down. I just feel lousy today. Um, the mosquitoes have been vicious and pernicious. And what else happened? Um, that's it. I don't know. I hope you like this rambling vlog. Make sure that you give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you share this with your friends. And um, I'm going to make some funny faces on the camera. Maybe people will like that. Oh, hello. All right, time for mass in a little bit. I'm playing What Is This Place? Do you know what that song is? What is this place? We're all dreaming, only a house. The earth, its floor, walls, and a roof. Stars that are sleeping, something like that. And I don't know more. Yet it becomes a body that lives when we are gathered here and know our Lord is near. I'm just subbing for somebody like I don't e I've met this person maybe twice um so I don't even know like um I'm just kind of a last minute fill-in but there's been a lot of that lately and I don't like that um I see you pulling out some Facebook hey it's good for me because like hey I could make a little bit of extra but I don't like the fact that that we've just gotten to that where people are going waiting last minute to get subs that's just really wrong um like that used to be the type of thing where um I don't know I feel like that enables dysfunction but um, but I don't mind being the last minute sub. I don't know. No judgment. Making funny face. I like that funny face. Uh, so yeah, that's a story. I'm sitting here in Edison, New Jersey, which is a rather large municipality in uh, northern Jersey. It's very, very, um, it's just very much like any town USA. And so I'll be taking pictures of the church and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!